Hello, future millionaires and billionaires, and welcome to the insightful and informative video right here on my YouTube channel. As I said, such as today's video talking about tax free investing in Mzansi. And when we talk about tax free investing, we're talking about investing without having to worry about SARS, or having to worry about paying tax on your investment. Because some of us, as a retail investors, and the idea of tax looks complicated, look as if it's full of hard jargon for us to worry about, and also having to go stand on a SARS branch is a lot of work. SARS and Home Affairs, same WhatsApp group. So that idea becomes a little bit of something we run away from as retail investors. And on today's video, I want to break it down on how can you invest tax-free in the most simple and easy to understand way within the context of South Africa. So if you're new to my channel, guys, please do ensure you hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, be able to leave me a comment, tell me you're new to my channel so I can properly welcome you. But if you're an OG, always here supporting the content I produce, please do ensure as well that you like this video and also leave me a comment tell me what you think about today's video what wasting any time guys let's get into this video Hello, future millionaires and billionaires. Welcome to an insightful and informative video right here on my YouTube channel. As the title suggests, guys, I'm talking about investing tax free in South Africa. And why am I touching this conversation? Why am I jumping into it? Number one, we as retail investors do not talk much about this. We don't waste time to say topic, we ignore because we think, hey, I'm putting 300 rand per month, I'm putting 400 rand per month, I'm putting 1,000, 500 rand, whatever the case may be it's little money so i don't have to worry about tax we we'll look at that from a now point of view but we'll look at the long run how tax comes into impacting our investments in the long run and i want to have this conversation about you guys today but i must put a statement as always that i am not a financial research advisor none of my video guys could shoot as financial advice but only for educational purposes second thing guys this video is proudly brought to you in a collaboration with the center tricks now app guys this is an app that you can invest in using your tax-free savings account and be able to invest with low fee without having to worry about tax i'll put the description uh, i'll put in the description a link to the google play store to download the app as well as to go use for those who are using apple i know they're using apple store what do you call it <laughs> guys i'm an android guys i don't know what you guys are using apple i use i'll put the link of it i'll find the link and put it in the description of this video so let's get into it guys tax-free investing in south africa why is it important number one guys when you're investing you're investing for a long run we all are and in the long run you may in the short term right now as you are putting in your 100 rand 200 rand you may think tax does not implicate there's no tax implication for you but guys there is a lot of tax implication when you invest especially in the long run and after 15 years of investing you're going to withdraw your money SARS will be no kick say to go 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 i want my portion of that investment of yours that money you work so hard to invest i want a piece of it when your centric top 40 etf start paying out dividends sars is there go 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 i want my dividend tax i want 20 percent of those dividends you are earning even if you're saying hi bo what if what do you no sars wants his portion and for us retail investors there are two two main tax implications that comes with our investment number one as mentioned is the capital gain that we get from the investment you have for example you invest for the next 15 years five years you make a little bit something you know, of yourself there and you withdraw that money want to spend it on that gold of yours you're investing for sars comes go 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 i want my portion of that that's the first implication. Uh, capital gain tax comes into, that it comes into implication in that format. The second one as well, guys, is dividend tax. You invest in your Centrix, Top 40, JSE listed ETF as you like. They have all the Top 40 companies there. Your, your capital bank, your Anglo Gold, your Sibania Still Water, whatever that's in the Top 40, you bought it. Your dividends come in. SARS, 
Go, 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 go. I want my 20%. So you see how tax implication comes into for us as the retail investors. And we need to be smart when we invest and take those things into account. Because let me use the dividends, um, dividend income tax, for example, dividend tax. For example, guys, 20% of 100 rand is 20 rand. So if you get your dividends of 100 rand, SARS takes 20 rand, you're left with 80 rand. That's 20 rand that you should have been able to reinvest into a specific uh, ETF that you like and you got dividends from. Or that's 20 rand to buy a loaf of bread for yourself so you see how much you may think is 20 percent is nothing but it's a lot and in the long run imagine you're investing for 20 years how many 20 percent every single year it starts taking from your dividends how much capital gain tax it starts gonna take after your 15 years of investment so that's why it's important to look into tax-free investing when you are starting your investment chain. And how do you do that? That's the big question. How do I invest tax-free, Ivan? Number one. When you start your investment, obviously you draw up your investment plan, how long you want to invest. If you are looking to invest for a long run, you are looking to invest for 15 years, a tax-free savings account is your product of choice. I repeat that. If you're looking to invest in the long run, you want to invest for 15 years, 20 years, a tax-free savings account is your product of choice. This is because of three, three, three main, I thought this was four, guys. Okay, I thought this was four. Um, you have three main reasons. Number one, you invest up to 36,000 rand per year tax-free. That's money you can take out of your own pocket Throw it in there for, for the whole year. 36,000 rand. You put it in there. You can put it monthly or once off as a lump sum or quarterly, whatever the case may be. But in that financial year, 36,000 rand you can invest. No source is coming for that man of yours. Second thing. When the dividends come in from whatever investment products, ETF or unit trust you invested into, SARS doesn't get a cent doesn't get a cent it all goes to you and if you're smart as well those dividends when they come in you reinvest them again into that etf into the unit trust you love meaning in the long run guys listen to me listen to me in the long run not only are you avoiding tax not avoiding tax that's the wrong word to use i will draw that word and not only are you not paying tax because you're using a tax for savings account but also you're compounding your money over the years without tax you see, guys, you see how beautiful this product is. And the other thing as well, guys, when you use a tax-free savings account and you mix it up with your Centrix Now app, which I said I'll put the link to it in the description of this video, you're coding, you're getting, you're getting tax-free savings account automatic when you sign up on the app. Number two, the app itself has low-cost investing. Number three, guys, the app has all the centric unit trust and all the centric etfs there structurally created to be able let me repeat that i think i may have spoken fast structurally created to fit in within your tax-free savings account so when you pick a unit trust on a pick let's stick with etfs if you want to pick an etf in the centric now app and when i invest into the tax free savings account that you automatically get on the app it's already created that you all of them automatically fits in there so you don't have to look does this etf fit into unit trust because of the government regulation of what the tax free savings account can do no it's automatically created to do that for you <laughs> i'm not sure i can make sense guys but that's how the benefit of that one as well is and and you may be thinking Ivan, what some of the product them guys all the citrix are uh, products you know the top 40 gs listed one the old share index like guys i can go on all of them they are available on the now app in the Centrix now app guys literally all of them all of them and those who don't qualify to be classified as tax-free investment product they won't be you won't be able to buy them in the tax savings account but you can buy them in your normal account 
You see, and that's why we need to have this conversation about tax-free investing. Because imagine the 20 rand you'll be saving, for example, if your, your dividend was 100 rand, you get the 20 rand dividends, I mean, the tax that you were supposed to, because it takes 20%. So your, the dividends was 100 rand, you got, Sarah takes 20%, that's 20 rand, gone. Now imagine in the next 15 years, how many of them you will be paying. So that's why it's important. As well, if now you have a tax free savings account managed by a brand that's able to give you low cost, means you have more money to reinvest into a specific product you like. Like, <laughs> I don't know okay, if you're understanding, like, literally means you have more to reinvest and that's a conversation we need to have and that's a conversation we will continue to have in the next few months guys because i want to have this conversation about tax-free investing but i believe it's it really is important as well to ensure we cover it in land and cover it in more detail so guys it, Tell me the comment section of this video. What Centrix uh, Air product do you love? What is your number one ETF that you like or unit trust? Tell me the comment section of this video. I want to read all your comments. I will tell. I will reply to every single one of them, guys. As always, guys, I am Ivan Spizzle Sambo, your student investor. And thank you so much for watching. And let's keep on having the conversation around tax-free investing.